Hey everybody, welcome back. Thank you for clicking this video. So I had to come on here and see if anybody else out there is as obsessed as I am with this whole Gorilla Girl situation. <laughs> um, if you have the Gorilla Glue Girl, um, if you haven't known the other day, a girl, I guess she's a TikToker, but she also put, um, and they posted her video on her Instagram that she use Gorilla Glue spray in her hair to smooth down her ponytail because she ran out of her regular gel and she liked her hair to be slicked down. Well, it's been that way for like a month and her hair would not move. It's crazy. And so she's gotten so much popularity over this last few days because of it. It's like the whole internet is obsessed with finding out what's happening. Like I, I even followed her on Instagram. And now she has like over 500,000 Instagram followers. And now she's certified with the blue check and everything, honey. She ain't playing no games. But now she's considering suing the Gorilla Glue Company because she can't get this stuff out of her hair. And it's sad. Like, when you first see the video of her, it's, it's funny. You're like, wow, I can't believe it. Like, it's really stuck down to her head. And then she did another video after where she was, like, trying to show you that she tried to um shampoo her hair and everything and it's just not moving at all she even went to the emergency room and spent hours in there and they couldn't help her they like sent her home with some acetone or something but it's not working she had a video on her youtube channel um where i, I don't know another lady was trying to help get out of her hair but that didn't help because whatever they were using was burning <laughs> so it's crazy. There was a, um, like, I don't know if this is her that did it or somebody else, but they have made a GoFundMe page for her that's already at $5,000. And um, Gorilla Glue on Twitter put out a statement <laughs> that said um, they're very sorry to hear about the unfortunate incident. Her name is um, Tessica Brown. I think it's Tessica. And um, they're saying they're glad to see that she got medical treatment. They also made sure to put a little thing in here from the packaging that says um, it's not made to be used in your hair um, as it's considered permanent. And it says that our spray states in the warning label, do not swallow, do not get in eyes on skin or on clothing. It's used as a craft, home, auto, or office projects to mount things to surfaces such as paper, cardboard, wood, wood, laminate, or fabric. I guess in a way she could get them on technicality if it doesn't say hair, but that's crazy. Um, I don't know. What do y'all think? Leave me a comment. Let me know. Do you think she should sue? Um, it's crazy because somebody put on, I think it was Instagram. They did like a picture, a side-by-side, -side, and it was like, oh, she looks good for her age. I can't believe she's 40. And that right there, I was like, 40? <laughs> First of all, anybody grown knows didn't put that on your hair, but at 40 years old, you know good and dang well not to put that spray stuff on your head. Like, what? Somebody else was saying maybe she thought it was the Gorilla Snot, which apparently they make Gorilla Snot for hair. But it's clear when she showed the spray bottle. Like, if you was using that on other stuff, why do you, you, bought, you have the bottle in your home. So, obviously, you know it's used for other things. And you still put it on your hair. I don't know. I've always said, everybody is one decision away from being on the internet. It's always something I worry about. Like, one bad decision or one weird decision can make you internet famous. Is it going to be for the good or is it going to be for the bad? Like, this is working out for her because in the end, I mean, she might lose her hair, but she's getting certified on Instagram. She's got now all these followers on YouTube, which means, you know, they will monetize her channel. So she's going to get money that way. She's got the GoFundMe, so she's getting money. Celebrities are retweeting about her. She's all over, like, the popular um, gossip channels and all of that. So everybody's talking about her, so she's famous. But at the same time, it's like, are you really going to sue? I hope that was just like something she put out there just to get more attention. Because 
we're so sue happy nowadays. Like, how are you going to sue them for putting the stuff in your hair? They didn't tell you to do it. I don't know. I don't think she should sue. But she definitely got to figure out how to get that stuff off her head. Because somebody was saying she should shave it. But it don't even seem like it would still come off. Because it's, it's like really on her head. I don't know. What do y'all think? Leave a comment down below and let me know. Um, I definitely hope I hope it works out for her. And that she... Um, or I really hope, even if they have to cut all her hair off, that she didn't damage her scalp to where her hair won't grow back. You know what I mean? Well, I guess she's going to have to be investing in some good... She might get a good wig deal out of this. Some, you know, hair companies, they're going to be wanting to send her some wigs to model and stuff like that. She coming off. This one little mistake has changed her life for a while. And I think she's probably going to take full advantage of her 15 minutes of fame. And, um, I can't blame her, but I don't think she should sue. I think that was the whole purpose of me coming on here. Like, do y'all think she should sue? <laughs> but hey, it's funny. And it's, it's like, if you go to Twitter... The comments are hilarious. It's like you you could you just fall down the gorilla glue girl rabbit hole on Twitter because the comments and the posts are just phenomenal. It's a, it's amazing. If you have Twitter, go over there and search gorilla glue girl and waste a few hours of your life like I have. <laughs> So yeah, leave me a comment. Let's talk about it because this is hilarious to me. And um, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.